Hi everyone. Today I'm going to take you through how to create a snapshot report in Sales and Success Center. You can see here I'm in the Sales and Success Center and uh, there's a little bit of a new process here to create a snapshot report and to create a new account. So let me walk you through what that looks like. From your Manage Accounts screen over on the top right hand corner you're going to click on Create Prospect. This works in a very similar way to how it did before. We want to use the easy account create to search for a business. Once you find the right business here, you select it, hover over and click on continue. This takes you through to where uh, the screen looks a little bit different than it did before. We're still going to pull in as much information as possible here but some of the information is in a different spot. You can see here we've pulled in the address with including the, uh, the address itself, the city, and the zip code. You can select if it's a service area business, if this is a business that doesn't want to show its physical address online. We've pulled in the website and the phone number as well. What we've, the reason that we've switched some of these areas around is so that you can create the account as quickly as possible. With this information that's pulled in, I could go and create the account right now. But sometimes you want to add a little bit more information at this step. So if I go down to the full business profile, this is where you can change the hours of operation, add in holiday hours, descriptions, as well as some of the things like the share of voice keywords and the competitors as well. If you know that they have a social URL that you don't see, you can also add it in from this stage. The other area is administration. From administration, you can add if there's another salesperson there or you can tag the account as well. Once you've added the necessary information, click Create Account. This is a little bit different as well. Once it creates, you can now see there are some options on the top. Previously, where you would have added the contact directly in that form, you can now add it afterwards. So if I click Add Contact, now you have that ability to add in a name, an email, whatever information you can for that contact. You can also do things like add that contact to an email campaign, create an opportunity on the account so you can track what you've talked to them about. And this is where you're going to generate a snapshot report for that account as well. Once you've done all of those, uh, those pieces here, you can either click go to new business to see them, or you can go back to the manage accounts page as well. You'll see in the manage accounts page, that uh, that business is now in. It's underneath the hot lead accounts. If you hadn't created a snapshot in that last screen, you can always add it down here from this little piece of paper with a plus sign and add them to a campaign in that way as well. So there's a little difference in the way that you create an account and that you create a snapshot report, but we hope that this made it uh, easier for you and quicker to create uh, all of those accounts, all those snapshots to make your selling process a little bit easier. Thanks.